Uh, now we're going to install the transmission flex plate. It's what the uh, uh, transmission uh, bolts to, the torque converter bolts to it, it bolts to the engine, the starter grabs those teeth on the edge. So uh, we're replacing that big heavy flywheel with the nice light flex plate. You can't uh, attach an automatic transmission torque converter. Um, GM flywheels are often, depending on the displacement and the application, they have a weight on them. Um, oh, it's even stamped engine side, so you don't screw this up. It is easy to screw that up. But they're weighted, so it has a hole and a dowel you have to line up in order to get the counterbalance that's welded to the flex plate in exactly the right place to balance the engine correctly. Um, Mark is putting blue Loctite on these. Uh, there's three grades of Loctite. Blue is like service grade. It, you can break it loose with a wrench. Um, you use red and you're going to tear stuff up trying to get it apart. Um, so he's going to put these bolts in there. These are bolts specifically for the flex plate. They're not the same bolts that we're holding the flywheel on. Um, he gets all six of them in there um, and torques them accurately as well. He'll use a, a screwdriver or a punch there as a counter there. You can't really do this on the engine stand.